You recognize these outfits? They all have one thing in common. Bauhaus. Yes, they all take inspiration from a 1920s design movement which originated in Germany. This is how block buildings affected fashion. Bauhaus. Translated from German as building house. It started as a school in Weimar, Germany, and it gave birth to buildings like this. The lack of ornaments and push for clean lines affected other spheres of art, such as ballet and fashion. Almost 100 years later, these influences still permeate the fashion realm. I'm Anna Gorke, and I'm a fashion designer uh, following Bauhaus aesthetics in my work. Despite their differences, both approaches have the basic features of Bauhaus in common. One is the very expressive way and probably also the most known comes from the Kreatische Ballet and it got famous from David Bowie and then Lady Gaga. The other side though is my way of uh, approaching to fashion. is more aesthetically, more silent way. Very straight silhouettes, straight lines, symmetric lines. Despite their differences, both approaches have the basic features of Bauhaus in common. The geometric shapes and lines, the colors, and a need for collaboration. All present in the initial Bauhaus school of the 1920s and in its initial architectural constructions. While working or doing my collections, I learned more and more that I have a strong connection to my upbringing here in Weimar and uh, my studies at Bauhaus University. I think what mostly shaped me was to grow up and to live within these buildings. Like the campus and the Van der Felde building, you see all these great shapes and clean lines, simple construction, but so powerful. There's sort of a spirit here. And while its origins may be German, Bauhaus is present in catwalks all over the world. Yves Saint Laurent did that with the Mondrian collection and the Mondrian dresses and recently Alexander Wang did the two and had some very obvious visual references to the Bauhaus. It's more than just an art form, it's, a, it's an understanding of living and there are so many movements that came afterwards that reference to that because it's timeless.